Christianity is war. We are at war, all those who have decided to follow Jesus. They have made a decision, a life and death decision, that they will be in heaven together with the saints. They have they are firmly decided in their heart where they're going. That's the way it is. And all other thoughts are from below. All that would defer you and all that would get you away from your heavenly calling, you know right well where it comes from. This is Satan's work to undermine you, to get you to change your mind. But don't listen to him. It's lies. It's lies. Everything he says is pure lies. He's the father of lies. The only thing you should be thinking about is that I'm not going to sin. It's the only thing I should be thinking about. I am not going to give in to sin. I don't care what happens. Just like Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego, they said, you can throw me into the fire, you can do whatever you want. We're not careful to answer you, they said to the king. We're not careful. We're not, gonna, we're not listening to what you're going to say. Do anything you want. I am not going to give in and bow down. That is the spirit that triumphs over sin. That's the only thing you need to be gripped of. Let everything else go. What other people think about you, like we heard last night, let other people think what they want. Uh, they're going to think it anyways. They're going to think it anyways. Don't be a fool. A fool gives in to sin. You are a fool when you allow yourself to be fooled by the devil. But the point is, and who is it that hasn't been fooled? I've been fooled. But you don't need to carry on being fooled anymore in your life. The point is that I should become to this seriousness so I understand I'm sober. I understand what's going on in the temptation. I understand what's going on in my daily life so I'm wide awake. I have my senses exercise to discern between good and evil. And that comes through faithfulness. All those who believe, they will not be put to shame. And you will, God will raise you up as a testimony. Uh, so don't think about anybody else in the days to come. Think, take heed to yourself, as we heard, and to the doctrine, and continue in that. And in that way, you will be an example to the believers. Oh.